Hey everybody, coming to you live from my floor. I have humongous empties, so all my empties I've been gathering on the floor here. Um, so yeah, I have a lot of stuff. So this is from whenever I filmed the last one till like literally today. Um, so I have a whole bunch of these samples from L3 that I've been using. Uh, so the first one's Midnight Blue Citrus. Um, lemon curd, cotton candy, fresh picked strawberries. That was really nice. Um, Iron Islands. Sugar Plum. I actually did that one last night. That was pretty nice. The next one, I actually have these two going in my bathroom right now. And it's strawberry jam, whipped cream, vanilla pound cake. And then cleaner than my mama's house, Gain Island Fresh. Fresh picked strawberries, lemon curd. Um, strawberry pound cake. And then Little Peach of Paradise, Boardwalk, Mallow, Clouds, Peaches, sh Sugar, Milk. I think I have a... F oh, here. Uh, Cali Comfort. This one was nice. Mm. I don't know what the notes are in this stuff, but they're really nice. Okay. I have a Make a Splash Body Wash from Sensi. This was amazing. Ugh. Um... I'm just going to kind of go Spitfire because I have a lot. Um, I went through two bars of the Dumbo. Really nice. My whole bedroom smelled really good. To me, it's like lemon, peaches, and cream. Mm. Uh, I might pick up a few more. Um, the one bar I had was like turning colors because I got it so long ago. Um I uh, have a bar of My Hero and then a bar of Mystery Man. I have a lot of wax, people. I have a bar of Ocean. <sighs> I got more of this in the flash sale because that's really good. Um, I went through a Yankee Candle wax melts in Catching Rays. This is so nice. It's like super fresh and clean. I highly recommend that if you can ever get your hands on that. Um, I went through one scent of the month for April, so that's Ruby Nectarine, so I made samples of this. It's okay. I have to warm it and see how I like it. I went through a bar of Atlantic Air. So I actually put four cubes in each of my warmers, and my whole room smelled very, it was like a light, fresh scent. I didn't want anything crazy in my room. Um, I went through the rest of Hemingway. I think I had, like, four cubes left. I warmed this in my bathroom, and it lasted, like, two days. Definitely a stronger scent, but I just didn't want this in my bedroom, so that's why I warmed it in the bathroom. I went through a bar of Pink Haze. Mm. And then I had four cubes of hazelnut frosting. I got this in, like, a swap when I did with, um, somebody on YouTube. This was really nice as well. That was in the kitchen. Um, I finished a brick, personal brick, of Jammy Time. And you can only get these type of bricks in um, the Scentsy Club. So I actually, when I use the bricks, I do cut them for little, cut um, each cube into littler cubes. But for a larger warmer, I just put the whole thing in and it'll last for like two days. So... Um, I definitely, this definitely took a while to finish because this is a lot, but, um, it's exciting. Okay. I have so much wax. Okay. Oh, wait, I have another L3 in Summer Love. <clears throat> oh, okay, here. Um, I went through Two Quiet Grove... These bars were discoloring, so I decided to use it. I'm actually using this today in my room. And then I also have two My Dear Watsons, just because they were getting discolored. So I actually mixed this with Quiet Grove. And my room really smells really good today. So I'm pretty excited about that. I have Down the Aisle. This was a really good bathroom scent. It smells good. Um, upstairs in the living room, I have Make a Splash. Very nice. Melanie Aquatic Scent. Um, this Vanilla Oud had like two cubes. Ugh, my all-time favorite scent. So good. Okay. I 
really needed to, I really need to like um, use my stash to have so much wax. So I decided to mix Oodles of Orange and Rock and Ruby, Rock and Ruby Raz. And Oodles of Orange, it smells really good in the clam, but warming, I don't like it. Um, reminds me of like Wassail Wonderland. I hate that scent. So that's not for me. Thank God I'm done with it. And then I used up a Rock and Ruby Raz. This is definitely like a raspberry, berry scent. Definitely really good. I went through a bar of French Kiss. <sighs> so nice. So nice. Smells like brown sugar and fig. Um, I went through a Lucky in Love. To be honest, it smells like a Victoria's Secret Love Spell, but I just don't get any performance out of it. It's Okay. Definitely enjoyed it while I had it in the warmer. Um, this one, Wild Black Cherry. This makes my room smell really good. <sighs> kind of regret not putting that in my club, but um, it's fine. Okay, uh, I went through two pods and Tropic Tango. Disgusting. Mm -mm. Glad it's over. It's very much potent for me. I don't like that. No, no, no. Okay. Guys, I didn't even get to the bag yet. This is all stuff that's outside the bag. I've been really good about using my wax. Okay. I have a I'm snow over it because, like, literally last week it was snowing. And then today it's, like, 50s. Um, yesterday, like, a couple of days ago it was, like, 70. So I warmed this upstairs really nice. Um, I went through a bar of vanilla suede. I actually think that I had two cubes used up and then I used up the rest of this. I recently took this out of my club just because um, Vanilla Oud is a little bit of a better performer for me than this one. So I took this out of my club. I think I have one bar left, um, but I'll definitely enjoy it. Obviously, that's a sign. Put it down. World Traveler. Amazing. Club scent. Uh, God, I ordered some of the flash sale. I should have ordered more, but... I'm speechless. This is amazing. Um, I went through a bar of Kahiku Kula. Pointless. Useless. Doesn't smell like anything. That's all I have to say. Ambrosia. Really pretty scent for the bathroom. So I have an etched core warmer in the bathroom. And um, I put five cubes in there. And my bathroom smells amazing for like four days. This is a really nice scent really really nice scent uh, another bar of ocean um oh god i kind of regret not putting this in my club um just because it's such a really good performer um i went through a bar of maui mist this is really nice um i had it in my club at one point but i did take it out just because i feel like it's like a generic scent um definitely really good um, I went through a bar of Hendrix. This was in my club. I'm not a big patchouli fan, but I did really enjoy this one. And I love Ghostly Greetings, which is another scent that's in my club. Um, I took this out of my club just because when I warmed it, I warmed it by itself. And it was just too much for me. And it kind of gave me a headache. So I felt like since I knew that it was going to do that, I just wouldn't ever use it. Um, so really nice while it lasted. Um, definitely fun to try it out. Um, went through a bar of cashmere and corduroy. Amazing. In my club. Forever in my club. That's a forever scent. Okay. I did my bar of toasted marshmallow, which I got for the Easter collection in 2021. This is really nice. I actually mixed this with Arctic Kiss the day that it snowed in my bedroom. Um, I didn't, I really wish I got the toasted aspect, but I got more of the marshmallow sweet, which is fine really nice kind of um a good for a mixer um i went through a bar of stargazing this is kind of a, a scent that i put literally anywhere so a very clean fresh florally version of jamie time but different on its own way this was in my club but i did take it out just because um i took this one out and cuddle or snuggle up just because i much prefer jamie time um I feel like Snuggle Up is a little too much for me. I went through a bar of Now and Zen. Ugh. 
really hope they, they bring this back very shortly. I took this out of my club, um, kind of regret it, but it is really good. I think I have a few more bars left. Guys, I still have this whole bag. <laughs> And then I have two bars of aloe vera and ivy, a recent take out of my club scent. Just because I kind of have a little bit of stockpile left. I think I have like four bars or three or four or something around there. Um, but yeah, two of those really good scent. Okay. I'm just going to pull out people. Oh, cool. I have two bars of Daydream Oasis. Really nice. Oh, just kidding. Three bars. I went through a pink rhubarb, a pink rhubarb sugar. Not a favorite of mine. Too sweet for me. No, no, no. I don't like that. Um, one that I really am enjoying is the Shoreline Drive. It's a very fresh... Um, aquatic salty air scent and i love that saltiness smells really good okay um the next things i probably should have gotten this a little bit more organized because i know i have like repeats and stuff okay i have two bars of the first kiss fireworks from the finder happy collection doesn't really smell like much i actually put all cubes in my bedroom and just really didn't get anything so all good i went through a wild barefoot and free find your happy this is really nice i actually saved my other one for when it gets a little bit warmer just because that's a really nice scent um i know i have more of this collection that's why i'm like trying to oh yeah here um i have two um showered in flowers this is really nice two florally uh perfect for the bathroom so those were in the bathroom i have a salted lavender from the international wax collection this stuff was just really getting old discoloring this is really nice um i really enjoy lavender scents this is like a manly lavender scent oh really nice um then i have another scent the window still breeze this is actually a collection that i bought when i wasn't even a consultant that's how old this is this is okay. Um, it's very much a musky, clean scent. They're very different. That was in the bathroom as well. Um, I have a Star Wars uh, light side. This one was pretty good. It smells like a shampoo, conditioner type of vibe. Um, I went through an Apple Teeny Splash. This was okay. Not my favorite. And then I went through a Summer Moonlight. Now, this one I was pretty disappointed about just because of the strawberry in it. I think I'm going to give it another try, maybe in the bathroom or something. But in my bedroom, I did not like this at all. Um, I went through a Vitamin R. This one smells really good. I believe I put this in my club just because this was a really well performer in my bedroom. And I really like that scent. Um, I went through a bar of graduation. It was okay. Trying to, you know, use my stuff up. I went through a welcome little one. This, I got nothing from it. Uh, my bathroom smelled like a bathroom. Um, didn't really like that one. I'm throwing stuff. Um, I went through a lucky star fruit from the international collection. This one was okay. This one, it, for the first few hours, it smelled okay. And then the last, it just wasn't performing. Um, I went through a vitamin U. This one was actually really nice for the upstairs. Bear with me, people. I have a lot. Okay. Good Lord, there's so much. Ugh. Okay. Okay. I went through a Mandalorian Air of Adventure. This didn't smell like anything. Um, Down the Aisle. Really good scent for the bathroom. Now, I believe this bar only had three cubes left in it. So, that was a bathroom for me. Um, I went through a pink sugarberry mint right here in my bedroom. This lasted, like, forever. 
I had to take it out to change the scent just because it was, it was like just amazing. Um, DC Justice League. This is in my club. This mixed with Mystery Man and then one cube of My Hero Anywhere in Your Bedrooms. Amazing manly scent. Never coming out of my club. French Lavender, one of my loves. Really good for when you're going to sleep. Thoroughly enjoy that. Um, my favorite, two bars of Fiji Flower. Oh, God, it's like so aquatic and florally at the same time. That's a bedroom scent for me. I love that scent. Um, I have another DC Justice League. Uh, one Marvel Nine Realms. I don't even remember warming this. This smells really good. This smells really good. If that ever leaves, I'll probably put that in my club. That one's really nice. I have a Disney Ariel Under the Sea. Ugh. Yeah. This one's really good. Really, really, really good. I think I got that from a uh, sale. I don't remember. I have a Catching Z Sleep Happy. Um, that's all I gotta say. Lights Out. And then Snuggle Up. This is way too strong for me, so I took it out of my club just because it was giving me a headache. Um, those, oh, just kidding. I have a shut eye. This is the only one that I really liked. Um, and then another sleep happy. Um, pff, these were all, sleep happy smells like baby powder. Those were all bathroom scents. Um, anything that I don't like in my bedroom that goes in my bathroom just because, um, no, no, no. Um, I have a strawberry basil. This one was Okay. It was just time to, you know, let's go use my stuff up. Um, need some room for some new stuff. Basically, that's what I'm trying to get. Oh, this was the Tropic Tango colder for the thingies. Okay, people. Oh, here. Oh, um, Lavender Violet. So this was actually a heartbreak for me. Um... When this collection came out, um, I was um, in quarantine because I had COVID. So unfortunately, I couldn't smell any of these scents. So um, when they came out, you know, they were out and I still wasn't able to smell anything. Um, now I warmed it and I fell in love with it. Now, you know, I can't ever get it. So whatever comes back, comes stocking up on it. This is really nice. Okay, I went through a Hey Tiger Lily. I'm not smelling it because I don't like this scent at all. Uh, sea Salt and Avocado. Ugh, so good. Blue Grotto. Very much a citrusy scent. Um, I have a Squeeze the Day. Palm Trees and Ocean Breeze. This is so good. Ugh, so good. I went through a bar of Luna. This is really nice. Um... For just like an everyday scent. Um, perfect. And then I have a Vanilla Waves. I actually mixed this with Squeeze the Day. It was okay. Um, not my cup of tea. Okay. I have a Cozy Sweater Wax Sample from L3. And then Beautiful Day. Okay. I went through Pods in Best Berry. Ooh, not the best scent. They keep, no, it doesn't smell like anything. And then I have pods in Mystery Man, which don't smell like anything anymore. Okay, I have a wax melt in the Yankee Candle Warm Lux Cashmere. That's really nice. The same type of wax melt in Pink Sands from Yankee Candle. And then the same type of wax melt in Sage and Citrus. That one was really nice. And then I have a Centerpiece Easy Melt Cup in Majestic Mount Fiji. This is a really nice scent. And then the same type in Warm Luxe Cashmere. Really yummy. I have two things of dryer discs in French Lavender and Ocean. 
I have a Bath and Body Works body wash and stargazing meditation. That's really nice. Another Cecil Avocado body wash. I went through a hibiscus water uh, hand soap. Counter clean and sun kissed citrus. Don't like that scent at all. And then I have a Scentsy Fresh in Luna. So those are all of the empties. Um, this is, I have a lot of empties. But I actually have two bars of wax here that I genuinely cannot finish. So each of them have four cubes in them. And the first one is Iridescent Pearl. This does not smell good. I don't like this at all. Um, ugh, gives me the chills. This smells like aloe, water, and cucumber. And I hate that scent. So I don't like that. So those four cubes will be actually going to be thrown out. Um, I hate throwing it out, but, mm -mm. and then Mahalo Coconut. Ooh. To me, this smells like not good. This smells like a rotting pineapple coconut. Ooh. Nope, not for me. So we're going to unfortunately have to throw those cubes out because I'm never going to use that ever. Um, so I really hope you guys enjoyed. I know this is a lot of wax, but I am slowly decreasing my stash just because a lot of it's like discoloration or a lot of it's like the oils are seeping up so my goal is to really you know start using my stuff up but then as you can see my flash sale I kind of stocked up a little bit on the wax but it's just stuff that I know I'm going to use so I really hope you guys enjoyed um let me know um what's one scent that you cannot stand from Scentsy or anybody um the iridescent pearl and the mahalo coconut just not for me um so i really hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys later bye